So I want to show you the scrapbook that I have started for Costa Rica. I'm trying to catch up on some of our photographs and this is Costa Rica in 2017. We went to Costa Rica with our friends Dave and Linda Avens and I don't know if you can see but do you see that they actually in their tortillas have little messages? This one is uh, Felices Fiestas which is happy partying. This one is uh, mil gracias, which is uh, many thanks. Never had seen that before. I made this with my Cricut um, machine. I love that it had the little toucan bird, which is, of course, the symbol, the, the national bird of Costa Rica. I have lots and lots of pictures you have left to scrap, but I'm going to show you what I have today. I tried to do a tree and just show some of the birds that are in Costa Rica because there are many, many birds that are beautiful hummingbirds and all sorts of birds. So I cut this tree again with my Cricut Maker and uh, then added the birds, cut the pictures in circles and added the birds. It was really hard to get a picture of a toucan because they are up in the rainforest, but in this photo, you might can see there's an actual toucan sitting in the tree there. We're up in the Monteverde rainforest. And so I had a little sticker of a toucan but we did actually see one. Here are some of the many, many hummingbirds. I forget how many types of hummingbirds Costa Rica has, but it has lots, um, hundreds of types of hummingbirds, I think. So if you're using this for school, homeschooling, you can get your kids to look that up. Costa Rica also is home to more varieties of orchids than any place else in the world. We went to the orchid garden up in Monteverde and took pictures of many of them. Most orchids are very tiny, just like this one. We, the big, the big ones, the cattleyas like we have here in the United States, mostly have been bred to be that big, but many, many orchids are very, very tiny. And we really enjoyed our day there with the orchids. Here's some more at the beginning of the Monteverde uh, orchid, botanical orchid garden. Here's me trying to play like I'm an orchid. And as you can see, we had a great time walking through there. And this is in Monteverde, if you are in the Monteverde area of Costa Rica. Then there were more orchids. And so I created a pot uh, with an orchid plant with my Cricut Maker machine. And then added some more orchid pictures. Um, and they, they just have so many beautiful ones. And then moving on, besides birds and orchids, Costa Rica has lots and lots of butterflies many, many hundreds of kinds of butterflies. So we, these are some of the ones that were just floating around the hotel where we stayed, the Monteverde Lodge, which is the place to stay if you're in Monteverde. And um, so I tried to get pictures of the butterflies as much as I could. And then um, this is Monteverde. This is the lodge we stayed in. I gotta see if I can prop this up for a minute. Let's see. <clears throat> Yeah, uh, Monteverde is one of the cloud forests in the world, and it's just a very simple lodge, lots of wood, really, really pretty. Um, you can see a little bit of the entranceway there in the upper left. Um, they had a resident cat that was always out and about. We also had resident monkeys, and the monkeys would come up to the windows of the lobby of the lodge and look in to see if anybody was eating anything. So we had a good time watching the monkeys and in Monteverde. Okay, and then we went hiking a couple of different times into the national parks. So this is in uh, the Ricon de la Vieja uh, National Forest, and there's many, many mud pots, and as you can see, uh, steam coming out of the mountains. There's Bill and one of the big, huge trees. Freddie, our guide, is on the lower left with my friend Linda. And then um, the last page that I have done, and I'll share more with you later when I have done more of this album, is we're still hiking in Rincón de la Vieja. And uh, you can see the map of some of the places we went. This is my husband, Bill. I got bug bitten very badly. You can see all the bug bites on my ankles. I should have worn socks. Lots and lots of bugs up there in that rainforest. So that's the end right now of what I've done so far for the Costa Rica album. This is Sue Painter with Travel Changes Life. If you want to get my travel newsletter, just simply go to travelchangeslife.com 
slash travel news. I send an email twice a month and happy to share with you our travels, our travel tips and resources, and how we look at and scrapbook our travels. Bye-bye.